Hello folks and welcome to our quick look at Assassin's Creed Origins again. I know it's a third video, suck it up. The game's out soon and then it'll all be over. So anyway, this is a quick look at a mission. Sorry, I should introduce myself, shouldn't I? I'm Rich Walker and with me is Dean Abdu. Yeah, this is a mission that's called the Serpent of Serapis. Actually, it's called Fair Trade, but you're looking for the Serpent of Serapis, which is a legendary spear and it's gold. So we come out to this trireme that's at sea. And we've got to infiltrate the ship and find the thieving soldier who stole the spear and retrieve it from him. So uh, we're going as stealthy as we can. Uh -huh. nice uh, do you think it'll work out, Dean? Do you think I'll go full stealth? Um, I'm going to say, with you being an assassin and all, yes, it's going to go full okay. stealth. That's, that's the aim, that's the goal. Is it inspiring that I dove off my boat too soon and had to swim after the boat and that's why we've had to cross dissolve what. to me on the boat i think that's a good tactic you you have the boat hidden away thanks oh yeah that, that was my intention yeah. entirely thank Don't you yeah quiet. so yeah i was gonna try and ledge kill this dude uh so i've whistled to distract him uh to kind of bait him over to me and uh yeah he didn't seem to be having it at first it's like but there, i'm but like I'm is he is he coming in? And then, okay, he takes a weirdly circuitous route to get to me. And then the prompt doesn't come up to assassinate him. So the Y button on the Xbox and the triangle button on the PlayStation is to assassinate, as you can see there. So I just went and took the more direct route to him. But now I've raised some suspicion here. But I've retrieved the spear straight away. So we've got the gold spear quest completed. I could just jump off the ship now. But I don't want to do that. So anyway, this is a quick look at the menus as well. So this is all the gear you've got, the weapons and stuff. Loads and loads of different types of weapons. There's all this loot and gear system. Uh, this is a rare spear. Uh, and this is also a quick look at the skill tree. So just a kind of overview of hunter, warrior, seer. All these different trees you can feed into. You get ability points as you level up. Some take several ability points and so on. And you can also upgrade Senu's perception also. So yeah, here we are getting into a, a scrap with a Roman soldier fella, centurion dude. Uh, so yeah, I mean the combat's drawn comparisons with Dark Souls, you can sort of understand why. Managed to kind of get behind this guy. You got a lock on, uh, which I it took me a while to learn that you have to actually lock on to enemies. That tent never saw it coming. So yeah, clicking the right stick in does that a la Dark Souls once again. And uh, yeah, it's basically timing, but these guys are already screwed, so uh, that was an easy execution, an easy kill. And uh, that deck doesn't know what hit it, so uh, there we go. But well, it's very RPG esque compared to previous ones, and exactly. I like it. Exactly, exactly. So well. yeah, the loot and the gear and everything. But yeah, I mean, that's about it. I mean, you got this black flag mast traversal thing is back, and I uh, just thought I'd throw that in there and if you're, you're interested. Now the captain of the ship. Exactly. I rule the trireme. <laughs> so yeah, that was. Um, just a very, very quick look at one of the missions, one of the short missions, many sort of side quests you'll find in Assassin's Creed Origins when it's out 27th October. So uh, thanks for watching, folks. Um, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and we'll have a couple more Assassin's Creed videos coming your way soon. Thanks for watching again.